But next up, let's hear from a local businessman who came to town in 2007. And during his research, he looked at Washington, D.C., he looked at Atlanta, Georgia. But when it was all said and done, he decided that Charlotte was a great place to come and set up shop. Let's hear his story about how he and his business came to the Queen City. Hello, my name is Wayne Davis. I'm the president and CEO of Easy Ticks Ticketing Company, and we are a full service ticketing company headquartered in Charlotte, North Carolina. I was born in Robinsonville, North Carolina, uh, on the coast of North Carolina. Uh, farming community, a lot of uh, tobacco, uh, corn, um, soybeans, and uh, it was it was very prevalent when it was coming up. I used to work on the farm, uh, do a lot of different things to, you know, help make money and, uh, you know, do well for the family. Uh, but once I saw that farming was not going to be a way of life, I began to think of other ways that uh, to make money, of course, and uh, to say, how can I get out and re to reach my goal? I went to uh, the University of North Carolina in Chapel Hill, uh, and going there, I, I met a lot of people, uh, and I kind of set my goals in where I wanted to go. I still went into ROTC, uh, went to school on an ROTC, ROTC scholarship. I got a business degree from Carolina. After leaving Carolina, I, I went to get my master's at Golden Gate University. And after leaving there, I went into, um, I went into the Air Force. I left the Air Force, went to Atlanta, worked for a company called Sunoco and uh, got a chance to travel, work on the free trade agreement. That was the, the going thing at the time. I left there and then went into another company called Global Entertainment, in which is, it was a smaller company in which I helped build. It was an entertainment company. And uh, in doing so, uh, this is what started the whole ticketing background situation. When we do a show for someone, we give them uh, a box and in this box, we give them their we give them their will call, and the customer takes the will call. As, as you can see, it's labeled by last name, first name, and uh, it's easier for the customer to find, and uh, easier for the promoter to give out the tickets. When I was back in Buffalo, New York, I um, I was calling. Uh, one of the big three ticketing companies and they wouldn't respond to me. So I said, um, the way to fix this is to start our own ticketing company. After doing that, I went to Phoenix, Arizona and started another company. Uh, it's called GetTix.net with um, a company called Global Entertainment. I saw a need for um, a different type of ticketing company to service a different type of, of um, client. There are only about 30 or 40 of the big venues, but there are thousands and thousands of these smaller venues. Charlotte actually ranked very high in taking care and assisting minority businesses. So uh, via that the fact Charlotte was on the East Coast, we were going to base our business up and down the eastern seaboard and toward Texas, Charlotte became the perfect place because you could get out of here, go north, you could get out of here, go south, east and west, and it made it simple for us as far as travel. And the community is a good, strong community, but the community wasn't so large that our company would get lost in, in many other companies that were there. So I think being a, a company as we are, we've made a significant impact on the community. The community knows who we are and we begin to brand very well because of certain activities that happen here in the city. Uh, uh, the CIAA, you know, the spring breaks and different things that happen here. Uh, the Hispanic festivals and some of the NASCAR races, we've uh, made an impact here in the city. And the startup cost for, 
for us, we, for the ticket admission, it cost around $400,000 for us to get started uh, with all the system. We started uh, in two locations. We started here in Charlotte, North Carolina, and we also started in Texas, a place called McAllen, Texas. This is the homepage for EasyTix. And these where all our events are at. You can see everything here. Uh, you can just click on event information and all the event information comes up. The name of the event, the date, the time where it's held, the prices, the rows, seating, everything. And there's actually a seating chart available for them to see where they're For us, the, our biggest thing is our ticketing system. We own our own software. So to develop that software and to keep it up to date, that was a major expense for us. The software, the people, uh, then our lease, a place to go, and then um, traveling and equipment because we have to put equipment in every building that we, uh, that we communicate with so that we can get all the ticket revenue. Row A, center section, seats one and two. The name uh, came along and based on let's give the customer an easy system to navigate and make it easy for them to purchase the ticket. So thus the name, Easy Ticks. To assist the marketing uh, with the people, now we e-blast and we do the Facebook assistant and Facebook sending out the Facebook blast, the Twitters, the MySpace, and also the thing we do, the social site we post on 704, Charlotte Vibe, and uh, Mingleberry. We've known each other for longer than we've been married, so since high school. So I, I know the roots, and I know where it came from, and I know the struggles, and I know what it took to get him here. And I, So I know his strengths, and um, so he's he earned it the hard way. He worked really hard to get where he is to accomplish what he has, and I'm very proud of him. I recently was chosen by the Chamber of Commerce to go to a, a venture capitalist seminar in which you learn uh, how to uh, raise money. And uh, I was chosen as one of the five out of 107, uh, 107 companies to present to venture capitalists. It was uh, like the, the shark tank that you see on TV. It's just gratifying to know that you could do it. Uh, I knew that I had it in me. I just didn't know how I was going to do it at that particular time. And then, you know, with the support of my friends and my family around me, it became a, it became a reality. And uh, from the tobacco fields of North Carolina to, you know, to the boardroom of Easy Ticks, it's really, really uh, a great feat for me. <laughs>